right, this is a quick microscope use video. Um, with our microscopes, we use a compound microscope, Nikon E200s. Very nice scope for, for what, what we use them for. Just looking at some of the parts in the eyepiece here, or the nose here, we have the objective lenses, and then we have the ocular lenses. To get the total magnification, we use a 10 times magnification for the oculars, and then you multiply that by the objective number on there. So this is a 4x and 10x. So for using this 4x objective, our total magnification is 40 times magnified. So the specimen is 40 times magnified. Um, obviously, we have a stage here. We have a little stage clip that moves off to the side to. Um, hold that slide in place. Underneath the stage is our light condenser diaphragm and there is try and get focus here. Won't focus. But there's this little slider here on the diaphragm that uh, you move when you move the objective. So if you're at the 4x objective, you move this little slider diaphragm to the 4 position on the light condenser. Here we have the course adjustment knob and you can see course adjustment, that stage moves up and down very rapidly. And then the outside portion is the fine adjustment knob. Okay, So it moves the stage very, very slowly. When you pick up the microscope and how we store them, we store them with the stage all the way down in the 4x position. Okay. Now, when we start, we're going to start at low power, and this is a bacterial shaped slide. So I'm going to start at the 10x position, and I'm going to move that stage all the way up now. Okay. So the stage is all the way up, and there is a gap in between the slide there. Now, the first thing that I'm going to do, and I'm going to kind of hold this up at the camera uh, station here. I'm going to start with the course adjustment knob and I'm going to turn that towards me so the stage moves down. Now you can kind of see some gunk coming in on the, the uh, screen here, but notice how this is very large. All right, this is 100 times magnified and basically what this looks like is some dust on some part of the microscope. So I'm going to go past that large stuff. I'm using the course adjustment knob. And now I have what I'm supposed to be looking at. This is a bacteria at 100 times magnified. So I use that course knob to find that. And from there, I would use the fine focus to bring that into better clarity. Now this scope has parafocal capability, meaning that all I have to do to switch objectives is move the objective to the 40x position. Now notice how the image went out of focus. So from here, all I'm doing is using the find focus, and I kind of go, but looks like I'm turning it towards me in this case. Just the find focus, so the outer portion, not the course, and I turn that towards me. Sometimes you have to turn it away from you depending on the scope. And now we're looking at that bacteria at 400 times magnified. So 100 times and then 400 times. Now I'm not going to use oil immersion but these have the capability of using oil immersion, this 100x uh, objective, it says oil right on the lens. So when we're looking at our bacteria, when you do gram stains, what you would do is you would move the 40x objective out of the way and the 100x objective um, is still out of the way and you would add a couple drops of oil right to the slide and then move that oil lens into the oil. So this lens is actually touching the oil. And again, from there, you would just use the fine focus to um, view those bacteria. So here I'm able to actually see the bacteria without oil. Okay, here's 
400 times magnified. And here is 1,000 times magnified. So now we can really see those bacteria pretty good. They see the rod shaped and they're chained. So this is a streptobacillus a morphology and arrangement. Now, when we store these microscopes, when we were switching slides or whatever, move that stage all the way down. You would clean the oil off of this lens with um, some sparkle cleaner, which is in your um, one of your drawers under your station. So you'd use a, a, a dry lens paper to get most of that oil off, and then you would take some sparkle cleaner on a new lens paper, wipe that oil, and then another dry. So just dry, wet, dry to clean the oil. And this is the only lens that we have to clean. Okay, um, these other lenses, uh, the lens is kind of inside a little bit and if we try to clean them usually we ended up just smearing them up um, and making a mess of them. After you're cleaning that oil off, done cleaning that oil off move that to the 4x position and stage down and then you can store that microscope. Um, one thing I did forget to mention is these ocular lenses we do uh, we will have you clean these as well disinfect them um, before and after use um, because your eyes are close to those those oculars when you're using those. Alright, that concludes the microscope use video.